Last season, Maloney Pacers won the hearts of many as the young team impressed during the Basketball for Basketballers first season. Wins against eventual champions Defence Force and Petro Jazz saw the emergence of Akeem and Akil Boyd, who, still teenagers, embarrassed the more experienced players in the league. This season, however, it will be a new look Pacers, as the Boyd brothers are now with SOS, Imre Duke is now playing professionally in Spain, and Stanton Rose, who just won the MVP award and CBC Championships with Guyana, is off to college in the US. But coach Christopher Jackson Charles is not concerned about the loss of players. Our game is based on defense and being a team. So while you might say we miss somebody, we miss somebody, we have been here now for 27 years that we have missed this person and missed that person and then we come up with championships. So basically that's how we will go about doing it and we have the people, a team, and the letter I is not in team. So. He said it's not the first time it has happened, where other teams snap up his players after making their name with the Maloney outfit. But we did it when, we, when, when, when they said that we lost Miguel, and when they said we lost Tommy, and when they said we lost Boxer, and when they said we lost Keon, and when they said we lost Sean. So, obviously, why, you know, if we play basketball, and we train. Um, we, we play basketball, and we develop basketball the way it ought to be developed. He alluded to the program his club has, and while they produce players at an alarming rate, other teams who he described as poachers take them up. If it had to be that when we know to these players, they don't understand the loyalty and whatever, then so be it. We'll do it again, and we'll do it again, and you know, we believe that that will help children to make basketball in the long run. Mm. That is if they maintain the coaching ethics and the coaching teaching that they would have been taught in the money business. Because at the end of the day, if they don't use it, they just lose it. They play Shaq Attack on Thursday, and you can be assured, Shaq Attack will not have an easy game despite being more experienced, and Maloney may be with fresh, young and inexperienced faces. They have a very cerebral player in Christian, Koto Christian. He's a cerebral player in terms of the start of the game, the way how he plays the game, the way how he's unselfish towards the game and when he scripts his teammates. And he knows when to take over the game. Um, that being said, we have been successful against them in the past. Shakata and Maloney Pacers play at the GMPS Sports Complex on Thursday. Ian Wilson, C Sports Extra.